the team was a bit nervous and they were like, come on, come on, we have to rush. And all of a sudden we started laughing and we couldn't stop. Hey guys, my name is Shravan Shah and today I'm going to be having a conversation with Georgina from Elite. Welcome to Miss Mali, Georgina. How are you doing? Hi, I'm great. Nice to meet you. So happy to be here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, the first question I'm going to ask you. There are a lot of things that I love about the show. And do you know this that, you know, fans all over the world love watching Elite. Did you guys know this when you guys were working on this? Yeah, it's crazy. I mean, it's something that I think before all these like platforms Netflix existed, it's something you couldn't even imagine that they w- would watch your face and your work all over the world and it's literally all over the world. So, it's it's beautiful to to be able to do that. I think you don't think about it while you're filming because it would be sure too many pressure <laughs> too much pressure to be thinking about oh they they're, they're going to watch it all over the world like maybe millions of people but yeah i think i just you just focus on doing your work good and try to make it good and yeah just wait for what's to come after that so perfect so what i'm going to do right now with you is i'm going to play a game with you it's called the top pick where i will give you options i will tell you that you know you have to pick one scene that is and i will explain you what that is is and you have to tell me one scene that you connected with okay so the first one coming your way tell me one scene which was the most fun scene to shoot one of them is one scene from the second season it was one of my first day of shooting and it's a scene where we are in a party in fake Cayetana's house it's actually the house where i clean and i pretend it's my house it's like a huge amazing house and yeah. it was really fun to shoot because we were uh, dancing for i don't know like maybe one hour and the director was just telling us just dance and i'm, I'm going to record you just don't think about anything else so it was exhausting but it was really fun to shoot nice Wow. Next one. The most difficult issue. The most difficult. Well, there's one scene in the third season, spoiler alert. Um <laughs> uh, when Polo dies, I there's one scene where I go to him and I tell him that I love him once he's dead, so it was kind of difficult because I it's something you don't usually like it doesn't happen in your real life that your boyfriend dies in front of you and you have yeah. to speak out to him so that was difficult also because there was a lot of um extras around so everyone was really like um quiet and uh, focused but still it was kind of difficult to like get focused and concentrate but it was it was good at the end nice Okay, next one. The most awkward scene. Most awkward. I mean, not mine, but I guess <laughs> Lou and Valerio's relationship was kind of weird because they were siblings and they had to like kiss. So that's I think that's weird for anyone who watches that. <laughs> for um, sure. Yeah, I mean, at the end I think they did an amazing job and they told this story very well. But uh, when we read it on the script, it was very weird for all of us. <laughs> for sure, and I, I'm sure it was, you know, weird for everybody who was watching because I know I was like, what just happened? I don't know what just happened. I'm just gonna be like, this didn't happen. Okay, yeah. next one. Uh, a scene of yours that took the most number of takes. Most number of takes. Um. Well, probably the scene where Polo falls into the water, into the swimming pool, and I jump in and I swim, and I have to get to him, take him, and just swim into the the corner and take him out of the. Yeah. I don't know if it was the scene where we did most takes, but it definitely was exhausting, and it felt like we were there for hours. Hours. <laughs> Like we were swimming, I was swimming for so long, for so many hours, 
that at the end, I, I remember being exhausted. I got into my house after that day and I just died into my bed and I fell there and I was like, okay, I'm done for today. <laughs> oh my God, I can, I can, I can totally feel you. Oh. Okay, the scene that you didn't want to end because you were so much into the scene that you just didn't want it to end. There's so many. There's one in this season with Philippe's mother where in the last episode when she comes to me and she basically tells me to shut up about the abuse and she tells me that uh, nothing, uh, I will have anything if I just shut up. And basically it's like a, a power abuse situation. Yeah. And the actress, she's she's a French actress. She's amazing. Okay. And it was so great to work with her. And she was so generous. And before shooting, we would go to the next room, to, to the room next door. And we were improvising for 15 minutes. And so when we got into the room to shoot, we were both of us so into the scene that it was so natural. And I felt like, I mean, it was a bit like, anxiety because the situation was kind of hard but at the same time i i loved working like this with her yeah nice one okay the scene that uh where someone couldn't stop laughing i remember one we were outside the the school and we were almost all of us it was like polo guzman uh, rebecca and samuel and i and it was raining. I remember it was the last scene of the day. We were late, we had to wrap and everyone, like the, the team was a bit nervous and they were like, come on, come on, we have to rush. And all of a sudden we started laughing and we couldn't stop. And it was like, everyone so was so pissed off at us and they were like, don't laugh, we don't have time. And we, we just couldn't stop laughing because as I told you, once you think too much about it, it gets worse. So we yeah. were like, at each other's face and if you were not laughing you would like get your eyes up and see and someone. somebody would be laughing and somebody was laughing and it was like guys come on we have to do that we're never going home if we don't do this <laughs> nice one okay and the last one coming your way the scene which blew your mind with its writing with its writing there's one scene in season two of mm -hmm. Cayetana and Rebecca, mm -hmm. the Halloween party. Yeah, yeah. You know that? When of course. Rebecca, when Rebecca uh, like catches Cayetana and realizes that she is lying. And yeah. she takes me to a side and she's like, why are you lying? What do you think that, what, what, what are you trying to do? You know? Yeah, yeah. And I basically tell her like, uh, look, I didn't, I wasn't lucky not like you, like you were so lucky, I didn't have this luck, so I'm just yeah. doing fun to survive. And well, I love Claudia, the actress, she's one of my best friends, so I, I remember that scene with a lot of like, you know, love, it was... Yeah, that is so true. What I like about Elite is the fact that it's actually a show of the adults, but mentally these adults are stuck in their teens. Yeah, definitely. Don't yeah. you think that? Yeah, I mean, it's it's definitely, they don't have like uh, teenager problems. Like, yeah. not something, I think they are very adult and mature for their for age. Sure. And for they sure. have a lot of trouble that it's more common in like more grown up people. But also I think that Elite, it's, it's a series that what it wants is to entertain. And like the, the speed is very fast and a lot of things happen all the time so i think yeah it doesn't try to be like close to reality it's more yeah. like um, uh, that shows teenagers but that is not trying to show like teenager problems for sure for sure but does this ever happen with you guys that you know once you all finish filming the show okay your friends ask you about cliffhangers that hey please tell us what is going to happen please tell us what's going to happen does this happen with you guys very often yeah, it does. And also it happens with my friends, but also with like fans you find on the street. And they're like, tell me what is going to happen. And it's like, I'm sorry, I can't tell you anything. <laughs> they would literally kill me if I said it. 
Um, <laughs> no, just kidding. But yeah, it's like, and I think it's also fair and it's more, it's cooler to do it that way because if I tell you what is going to happen in the fifth yeah. season, there's no fun. It's no fun. So I, yeah. I think it's better to see it uh, directly into in the scene. For sure, for sure. But thank you, Georgina, for doing this. This is brilliant. And uh, like I said, you guys have fans from all around the world. You guys have a massive fan base in India. People from all around the world. Yes, people oh. love watching Elite. I, uh, I love you. thank you. Yeah, but you know, please keep doing what you guys do, and uh, love to you guys. The entire cast of Elite for pulling this show off because it's brilliant. It's just Thank brilliant. You so much. I appreciate it so Keeping much. Us. Thank you. Keep entertaining us. Thank you so much for doing this. Bye bye. bye. Have a nice day.